Welcome to Primo RV Center and a first look at a brand new just landed 2025 252 RBS in Forest River Surveyor Series. This is our most or fastest moving to, uh, floor plan from Surveyor. So it is something that it seems when it lands we get a lot of interest and they never seem to last long. So this one we've been without for, for too long. We're excited about some subtle changes here. We're going to quickly start on the outside and then we will head inside as well. So up front you've got a front power tongue jack. Very very handy when using a weight distribution system with your tow vehicle. Just makes it a lot easier to get up and down. We do have a leash tie off here for the family dog or if you don't have a dog certainly a wonderful spot that maybe secure bikes uh, if you had an external solar panel a generator any of those types of things you could certainly use that as a lockup point we have a lot of room back here for batteries certainly up to depending on the size battery up to three batteries uh, certainly two and to pair that with the standard still 400 watts of solar on the roof so that isn't necessarily going to be something they're going to offer forever but currently on this unit and uh, in the short term there is 400 watts on all survey units we do have a battery cutoff switch as well so that red dial that you'll see there and then just next to that the repeater for your um, monitor system for your tires so you do have a standard tire pressure monitor system here as well so certainly on those longer journeys very handy to have so you'll if you see a pressure drop you know it's time to to pull over and check on things uh, nice thing too when that battery switch is, is pulled uh, you're going to be getting full charge to those batteries while everything else inside is not drawing on those batteries which is very very handy here uh, we are lithium ready as well i should say on board as well many of our clients will use two six volts currently uh, certainly extend their stay be able to stay a lot longer on an off-grid site i think very shortly a lot of those uh, same owners will switch to uh, lithium certainly it's coming faster and faster these days we've got a great big windshield here as part of our front cap that just lets a lot of light in that front bedroom and you've got a nice high-rise stone guard here great pass-through storage so you've got a lot of room here to work with in the front great storage for things like the standard griddle with the outside kitchen we've just added a USB-C charging port here as well so very handy if you're someone who likes to you know perhaps work outside a little bit uh, needs a plug-in needs a recharge here and you'll notice your awning goes right up to that door and then extends right to the very end so you get a massive uh, awning here about 18 feet so huge that is where you're gonna live that's the great thing about this particular layout it just gives you lots of room under that awning plus you have that great outside kitchen we've got lots of windows on the door side as well so you can really see 360 here when you have to be inside we've got our standard Lippert steady steps here with the individual legs that you can adjust beautiful glass door here which everybody compliments these units on we've got the lend a hand here so as you come up those nice solid steps you've got something to grab onto we've got our Goodyear standard tire so that became a standard uh, as of last year in 2023 uh, we've got very easy to maintain rims here so something that's a, an alloy rim so less to have to maintain not paint's not going to be flying off of these we've got great entertainment on the outside as well we've got two speakers on the outside we have our awning light running the full length and then we've got an led scare light there as well so just a ton of light on this side uh, when you do want to be outside in your evening we've also got should mention here just behind our kitchen there is a port here as well so should you want to set up an outside tv viewing area there's an out to this side so if you had cable coming in the back side we've got a great little outside kitchen here so we've got a pre-season lost uh, lodge cast iron top here uh, so a suburban griddle uh, great appliance maker um, many stoves and fridges and everything else and we've got our great rinse sink here do some dishes extra little fridge should you have power another little customer feedback uh, they responded to so for this particular model year uh, traditionally you had just the cold water to work with that sink now you have hot and cold so it's a hot and cold outside shower and rinse port uh, so you could use it for all that great to clean off the bikes and stuff too or clean off the dog's paws before uh, they come inside coming around to our rear we have our standard hitch which continues so you're good for 300 pounds there so whether you have traditional bikes or if you're looking at maybe some e-bikes that might be 60 80 pounds uh, you're going to be well taken care of there you can also uh, slide a little rack there if you want to carry a generator or other um, cargo off the back here as well we've got our standard Lippert retainers here if you wish to add the Lippert proprietary folding ladder here um, that can quickly store away in the front compartment lots of room and it doesn't take up much room we keep it in stock if it's something you're interested in and then we've got our backup camera prep here so should you feel it necessary or should you wish to have one at any point you are all pre-wired with 12 volt wiring right there for you and that's something we can help you with here at Primo RV Center we've got LED lights tail lights across the back just added a little motion sensor light back here very smart because again if you're coming in at night you appreciate the ability to a see the jack but also uh, all your hookups are here so your your power your 30 amp service your black tank flush um, if you've got uh, sewer on site or if you're pulling in a dump station you can use that to clean those sensors 
got our cable in, and then we've got our city water in should you have it on site. We've got our dinette slide here that'll slide out a good three and a half feet. So great windows on either end that will open for some ventilation front to back. And then a huge viewing window here that just lets in a ton of light inside, especially on a darker day. You're really gonna appreciate that. And then we've got two emergency exit windows here. So one where our couch is in the living area. So something we can louver open, even when it's raining, have that one open. Additionally, the one next to it, we can do the same thing in the bedroom. So ones if you prefer to have, again, not necessarily using air conditioning all the time, but you've got two of those exit ports away from the kitchen, away from the, uh, the bedroom area, so you're always safe. We've got onboard water fill here on the back side, right next to our tankless hot water tank. So you really have an endless supply here of, of uh, hot water, so you're not limited to six gallons. It's just going to keep making that hot water. So if you're someone who likes the longer showers and you've got certainly water on site, you're going to appreciate, uh, appreciate having that. And then easy access with a slam latch on all our front outside compartments on the back side. We're going to take you in here. We're going to check out the interior here, which is quite exciting for a lot of people. They always love the interiors of Cerveres. They do such a nice job. We continually get great compliments here. So as we come in the door, easy access to everything. So if you're, you know, just on the road for a long period of time, you just want to jump in, have a quick nap, easy to get to the bedroom, or even just put up your feet here. Uh, if you want to put up one end of the, the lounger here, Lots of storage as we come in the door too. So just if you want to tuck away some basic items, even if you just want to hide away your wallet, you could certainly use the ones just above the couch here. And then we've got our thermostat here, easy access to that. As we come into the bedroom area, you've got cross ventilation here. They've just updated all the balances to hardwood balances, so really nice touch. And then they've continued with the higher end roller shades here. So again, really nice touch as well. You've got both USB-C and uh, 120 volt on both sides of the bed. Again, we've got that outside emergency window here. We've got great storage. You've got four drawers. But then additionally, full-size queen bed, 60 by 80. You've got, again, bulk storage under there as well. So easy access from both directions. They're one of the first to keep the CPAP machines in mind, but also just more storage at bedtime. So you've got a lot of storage spots here, as well as plug-ins there. Spot for a drink of water that you're not gonna knock over. And then again, the CPAP machine, should you have one, can sit in there as well. You've got the fold-away blackout shade there and then storage all the way around so just a ton of storage in the bedroom we are pre-wired in the bedroom as well for an additional television should you wish to have his and hers we do have a vent in the bedroom as well which you could cover with a cover should you wish and then we've got ducted air into the bedroom with the door closed and then ducted heat as well so you'll see the round heat vents so you're well taken care of whether it's a hot weekend or something that's getting a bit cooler here in the fall in the bedroom area you're going to be very very comfortable and then we've got another vent here just as we come in the door. So right out of our kitchen, making sure this area is getting nice and warmed up. As you can see with that slide head out, really opens things wide up. Very, very popular unit if people have maybe one or two dogs they travel with. Or myself, I've got a huge Newfoundland dog. Well, when he wants to lay out and cool down in this kind of layout, you've got the space to do that with the depth of the slide and just the way they've set it up. Nice and easy too if it's in the driveway at home and you're just trying to prep for the trip. With that slide out in, really nothing that you're generally going to need to get to is is going to be in the way so you can get to that kitchen you can get to the bathroom to get it cleaned up throw the things in the bedroom and then off you go so even if you're in road mode you know out on a trip again you want to stop perhaps just use the bathroom make a meal have a quick sleep again you don't have to open the slide out here uh, so a great benefit to this floor plan and i think some of the reasons they're so popular or this particular model is so we've got our awning switch as we come in the door slide out switch most of our interior lights and in exterior lights are all right here a couple little key hangers here very useful and then we've got our monitor system here for our solar. So that'll show how much we're getting in. So it's a nice way to be able to get a sense of kind of where the batteries are at without even having to walk to the back to your monitor panel in the bathroom to check on the batteries. Because you'll get a sense pretty quickly as you're out there, depending on how sunny the day is, how much return you're getting. So generally for most people, if they're working with two batteries, especially if they're six volts or lithium, what you've used at night, you're usually gonna get that return during the day. Beautiful lighter countertops for this model year. Contrast that with a nice deep dark Stainless sink, beautiful high-rise faucet. Love kind of the matching look here with a little bit with the uh, fixture of the dinette as well. Nice deep cupboards here just below for your bigger pots and pans. And you've got three great big cupboards here for all your dishes. And then all the drawers here just below right down to our standard in-floor sweeping mode for our vacuum. We do have a hose for that, which is currently just underneath that bed. So you can also use that to clean up in here quickly as you leave. Great little bottle opener here. 
And we've just added in a nice high range, a 21 inch range here. So this is something that you could certainly drop this down. You could cook a full size chicken, small turkey. So something you could do Thanksgiving in. So you can extend your season here and enjoy some, some home cooking here as well. So they've certainly listened to what people are looking for. They know with these units, very, very popular now. Uh, people are going out longer. They're listening. They're incorporating those things into your kitchen. So we do have the cutting board here that serves both as your backsplash, uh, but also drops into the sink, sink lid, cutting board, kind of all in one, so doing many things. And we've got great use of a dead space here. So we've got our spot here where we can put our utensils, uh, those kinds of things, big forks and spoons. And then we've got a great little knife rack here as well. So a little chef's kitchen here with lots of prep area. Of course, you could sit at the dinette as well. And then pair that huge fridge. We've got our Furion 10 cubic foot, uh, it's a 12 volt fridge, so 120 and 12 volt. So it'll work off that battery solar combination. Our converter here is lithium ready, as I mentioned on the outside. And then you pair that great kitchen with a massive pantry. So you've got a spot here to hang coats and you know maybe wet items, boots, shoes can tuck away inside here. But then you've got a great pantry. Love the fact that they put the netting in here. They thought of those who were again, traveling on those rougher roads. If you wanna go North Alaska, you know the Yukon, all those type of places, things will tend to wanna move around a bit more. And they've made sure they're not gonna hit the floor here. So well lit so at night you can see exactly what you're doing so you've got a great entertaining area here so you can certainly have family and friends in here a lot of space again if you're a dog lover you can appreciate the space in here cup holders on either end of the couch we've got a 120 volt outlet there so very handy if you want to plug in a laptop and keep in touch with those at home great storage in our dinette which also doubles as a secondary bed so it'll drop down basically anybody just a hair under six feet you know that 512 511 you're going to fit nicely in there if you're a little over that my son who is just angles himself and he finds it's quite comfortable big cross flow here huge viewing window so if you're lucky enough to have a bit of a view off your site uh, you're going to appreciate that we have smart television here now so nicely sized to fit the space so if you're lucky enough to perhaps be in a koa or something like that that does have uh, internet throughout satellite internet you can certainly take advantage uh, it's a google uh, smart tv so it works very very well and you can also pick up free channels, which I'm doing here over the air as well with your uh, digital antenna. We do have speakers inside and outside, so you can pair that with Bluetooth and you can stream music to it if you wish. And then we've got some storage there for your media and perhaps DVDs and things like that you may want to bring with you at some point. Great big bathroom here. So running the full width, so you get the benefit of having the storage aspect, not just the bathroom. So just a ton of storage here. Again, some hanging storage. Keep a few good church. We've got our Dometic pedestal toilet here, so it's going to be one that is uh, porcelain as well, so easy to clean, a little more like home. We've got our ignition here for our on-demand hot water tank. Again, GFI switch here, so if you need to plug in the hairdryer, you're all set. We do have standard tank heaters, so again, if you want to push that season, perhaps get into late November, early December, this is something you could certainly do with. Your, your tanks are all going to be uh, ducted with, with air as well, but you have the, the backup of... of um, the tank heaters as well so 12 volt tank heaters and then we've got our ignition for our water pump and uh, our water heater there as well so we also have the monitor panel that's integrated in here so we're going to have the ability to check on our battery levels tank levels just before we head out huge 30 plus inch shower here and you've got the great screen that comes across it's moldability resistant so it's going to help to again cut down the cut down the cleaning as well and it's uh, got a full stall here so you don't have to worry about the walls getting wet or anything else again they've listened to, to clients here so typically you'd have a, a single speed fan in here you've got a nicer quieter furion three speed fan so it'll be just an out fan but again three speeds so a little update here again things like the range that they've changed to as well Again, customer feedback listening to customers making sure that they're taking care of you and that's what we do here at primo v center come on down to see our brand new just landed 252 rbs in forest river surveyor series